welcome back to my channel beard bullet biceps i hope you're all doing good staying home safe today the video is about the instrument cluster provided by the royal enfield meteor and it is about the trip a trip b and trip f options provided in the meter before getting into the instrument cluster i just have two other updates first one is i have still not started any long trips the reason being i'm waiting for the registration number to arrive it would take 10 days for the number to arrive and at least 30 days for the rc card to arrive and i got this bike to have fun and not to pay fines to the cops seriously it's better to wait until i get the registration number and the second one is i just got the cover for the royal enfield meteor and here's the video and this bike cover costed me around 800 rupees i bought this from nearby shop here in sivajnagar in bangalore before buying this i had to verify the prices on the amazon app and accordingly i had to bargain with the shopkeeper he said it is 1200 and finally he gave it for 800 rupees the quality of the cloth is really thick and he did say it is waterproof i need to check that for me it was all about covering the bike from the sunlight and the cats and the people around here so that they don't scratch the tank or tear the seat cover now moving on to the actual reason for this video the instrument cluster let me switch on the bike the icons what you have here are on the left is the low fuel indication next to it the red is the low battery and then the neutral below neutral is the abs and complete on the right is the efi for now i'm driving the bike in reserve and hence you can see the trip f is already activated and the fuel indication blinking with regard to these options here the low battery the abs and the ef5 as soon as you start the bike and you ride certain kilometers maybe cross 40 kilometers per hour and even then if you see these icons visible on the display here which means there is something wrong with these options and that is when you will have to check with the service center to set the time ensure the display is in auto mode and then press and hold the info switch for 3 seconds and release as soon as you do that you can see the time blinking here and you can set the numbers i mean the time accordingly by pressing the info button and then redo the same by pressing and holding the info button which will move on to the minutes and then am and pm accordingly you can always toggle between the odometer trip a trip b and trip f by single pressing the info button and if you want to reset the trip a to 0 you may press and hold the info button for 10 seconds so what is trip a Trip A is something which can be used to track the mileage or the total kilometers used between each time the fuel is filled or when the tank is in reserve the reserve capacity of Meteor 350 is 5 liters so when you fill in the fuel during reserve you can track the mileage or the kilometers used from the time the fuel is filled in reserve till the time it again comes back to reserve Trip B can be used to check your total kilometers used during a travel You can reset it to zero when you start a new trip and check the total kilometers when you reach the destination or after your return. It is all about how effectively you use the trip A and trip B according to your convenience. Trip F appears automatically whenever the bike or the tank hits the reserve, so reminding us to fill the fuel. So what you see here on the display 44.9 kilometers, which means I have already used 44 kilometers of the 5 liters fuel in the tank. and this trip f will vanish if the fuel is filled above the reserve capacity as per the manual provided by the royal enfield it says you can ride 200 km in trip f conditions however i would say it depends on the mileage provided by your bike for the 5 liters reserve you have in the tank and it is not recommended to empty the reserve as it will result in fuel pump damage and that's it for today i suppose i have provided some information about the instrument cluster and justified this video I hope you like the video and do comment if you have any questions and finally don't forget to subscribe to the channel